my sword. I've made this type of video in a while, man, because Naruto sucks right now. We on a filler arc, like, for freaking however long, man, and it just sucks right now. Like, let me give y'all a fact on how much Naruto freaking sucks, if you don't know. We only had eight canon episodes last year. Yeah, yeah. You think I'm lying? I'm not freaking lying. Go back last year. Look it up online, it's a lot of stuff you can find out. Excuse me, I just burned. But it's a lot of stuff you can find out online. Go to Viz Media, go to freaking Crunchyroll, go to um, any other, go to uh, my anime list, go to all that, go to the Naruto uh, forum page, fan page on, uh, online and stuff, go to freaking blogs about Naruto. We only had eight canon episodes of Naruto last year. The rest of that year was filler. We had about, how many canon episodes did we have this year? If we even had it. I think we had probably, ugh, if we even had it, we probably had two. Two canon episodes in our show, and then that was it. But that ain't why I'm here to talk about this video, man. This video is about Itachi and the Akatsuki and stuff, and just my thoughts and stuff. Number one, uh, let me ask y'all a question. Have y'all seen the new Naruto Stone Four game? Have y'all played it? Because I haven't played it, but I've seen gameplay of it on YouTube and junk. And, like, how the Akatsuki is getting formed in this anime, and I don't even know if this is even, like, canon. I don't even know. I don't know if this is, like, some type of filler canon for Itachi, or if this is just mainly filler for Itachi. I have no idea. But I know in the Storm game, this is not how the Akatsuki was getting formed. Like, Orochimaru never got kicked out of uh, the Akatsuki. He was always a member. Um, but in the, it's doing stuff, it's having like canon things within this filler that is this Naruto art for Itachi. Like, for real. So, I'm thinking this is, like, filler canon, but it's pertaining to Itachi. That might be what it is. Or it might just be something else by itself, man. And the Storm, the storm game might be something different. Because I don't even know if the Storm game is, like, canon towards um, Naruto or something. I'm pretty sure it is. But I'm talking about how the Akatsuki got formed. Like, you go on YouTube, type in how Akatsuki got formed, and then watch that. That's how, um, that's how I did it in the Storm games and stuff. For the Storm game, not for the anime, man, because that's not what I'm talking about. Do it for the Storm 4 game, so. So I'm just sitting there watching it like, okay, like in the Storm game, Orochimaru was always in the Akatsuki. He's the one that went with freaking Kakazu to go get uh, uh, Hidon and stuff. He's the one that went and uh, helped Kakadu, Kakazu fight um, Hidon and defeat him. So he can join the Akatsuki and jump. That's how it happened. That's how all that happened. But with the other way, huh, excuse me, they doing it a different way. And I'm like, well, okay. Like, this is throwing me off, man. So I don't really know what's going on, dog. I have no idea what's going on with that. But I'm going to tell you something. The whole time I've been watching this filler, it hasn't been as bad as I thought it was going to be. And I don't know if that's because of my love for freaking Naruto. It might be. Like, I have no clue. But it just hasn't been as bad as I thought it was going to be. Like, I really thought it was going to be a straight bomb. It was going to suck. It was going to rehash and reshow things that we've already seen. Which they which they did, but they, they kind of didn't. Like, most of this filler arc has been, from what I can remember, about the canon of Naruto. Most of it has been, like, 80% new stuff that we haven't seen. Like, for real. So I'm thinking like Kishi got a hand in this in some way like hey do this with this but you can also add a couple of filler things like 20% of it is for like uh, filler stuff that we've already seen and 80% of it is like new stuff that we haven't seen because from somebody else's perspective from uh, Itachi's perspective so I give it a thumbs up for that but other than that I don't care for filler let's get back to the canon. Like for real, like I've said this in my last Naruto review, in my last uh, Naruto episode review or whatever. I'm not doing an episode review, this is just me talking about Naruto and Joe. 
Well, Itachi technically right now, but Naruto the series, you know what I'm talking about. And my last one, I was like, I don't know why they got, I don't know why they have so much filler going on, but here's my theory. And I said this joke, like way probably in February, maybe January. Like it's been a long time, I haven't did one in a long time, man, because Naruto just been sucking, and I haven't cared because it's just been on filler. Like filler, 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 filler. That's all they've been doing. So I haven't even thought about Naruto. But I was like, either Kishi is coming up, he cre he doing the Boruto manga, which he is because I be seeing people coming out with like Naruto, Naruto guiding or Boruto freaking uh, manga chapter re uh, reviews. Not like daily, but like um, might might be monthly or weekly or whatever. I be seeing it around. I don't be watching the videos, junk, but I be seeing like thumbnails for it. And I'm like, what is this? And I might watch a video on that just to know what it's about, man. And so, but he either doing uh, that manga or they're saving up their money, which they really, I'm, I'm pretty sure they are saving up their money because some of the scenes in this freaking filler is just, whoa, nigga, that art right there and animation freaking suck. Like, it is bad, man. <laughs> but they, it still gives you that Naruto feel for some reason. I don't know why. That might just be me. But either they saving up their money so that the rest of the Naruto uh, episodes can look movie quality. Look so beautiful, just mwah, gorgeous. Or the Boruto stuff. Only two things I can think of. Like I can't think of nothing else. Like for real, there's nothing else that's in my that comes in my mind that that, that gives me the impression of why they're doing this. Why they keep having these freaking filler art that we don't care about. But hopefully. Uh, um, during May, because everybody's been saying uh, in May the Naruto uh, canon episodes might come back, because everybody's been talking about or well, might come back in June or July or uh, August or something like that. But they're thinking about in May for it to come back and join. And if it does, yes, that's what I'm talking about, man. And I don't know if they pushed it up, because in the beginning, what everybody's saying is they were talking about June and July, but now they're talking about May, and I don't know if they pushed it up because they want to freaking put us on another filler arc towards the end of this year and like draw out the naruto freaking series more so freaking kishi can come up with more stuff for boruto so when it finally ends we can go ahead and get boruto i don't know if we doing that or if he just or if the studio is just saying hey let's try to milk this as long as we possibly can because they really are because man the freaking series ended a year and a half ago like for real and it's just been it's just been insane how long we've been without the freaking canon for we had eight canon episodes during that whole year and a half of the manga ending and then the rest of it was filler or they didn't even come out with an episode like my god man it's just been stupid crap but whatever um you know this is just my rantings of naruto itself because I'm just really, I'm looking forward to uh, next episode of the Itachi series because it's going to end next episode. Because if you saw the previews, the previews was what was of um, Itachi going in the village and him doing the first Naruto arc and jump, uh, seeing uh, Sasuke and Naruto in the hallway. And that's when uh, Jiraiya had put him and Kizame in his genjutsu of like a fog's mouth of jump and him. Uh, Kizane had got out of it and jumped. And then after that, like, it showed bits and scenes of the next episode. And then after that show, when him and uh, Sasuke was fighting and then he died. And then it showed when he was reanimated and him and Sasuke was fighting Kabuto. And then he just, his, his spirit went back to the spirit world or whatever. And his reanimation had uh, died and jumped. And it was just, it was great, man. Like, for real. I really, really, really enjoyed it. Let me see the previews of that, but yeah, man, I'm just freaking excited for this episode because it's finally going to end, and next episode is actually going to be the last episode of this month, because next episode is going to be like, uh, I want to say 20 something, like either the 25th or the 26th of this month or, so, or whatever, and then the episode after that, we're going to be in uh, May, so yes, thumbs up for that. But, uh, yeah, that's all I got for this video, man. It's just me just throwing my thoughts out there and what I've been thinking about Naruto and stuff and what's been happening in my mind in Naruto. I'm a long life, I'm a long lived 
Long live the long life of the fan of freaking Naruto. Like, I found out about Naruto in 10th grade. My cousin put me on to it. And then she was like, hey man, you need to watch this. It's Naruto. And then I sat down and watched all of the freaks of the first arc of Naruto when he was a kid. And, uh, and I loved it ever since then. And it's been a real up and down relationship with me and Naruto, man, because I love this series, but they just do stuff to piss you off and stuff. So, yeah. And that's all I got for this video, man. Thanks for watching it. Hope you enjoyed it. You like anything I had to say or you wanted to add on to something I had to say in this video, put it down in the comments and all that, man. But if you liked anything I had to say, like this video, share this video on all social media platforms, uh, comment down below so I can know your thoughts and all of that, man. And as always, subscribe always to the Danny Awesome Army and all of that, man. But yeah, I'm out, man. I'm Danny Awesome. You're awesome. Stay awesome. I love you for the peace, one love. I'll see y'all in the next Macho Rant, if I ever do one.